Hi, this is Janelle Holland with Hot Cherry Therapeutic Pillows, and today we're here at Binkley Healing Center in Ventura, California with Dr. Todd Binkley. Dr. Todd's been using the Double Square Hot Cherry Therapeutic Pillow for years now on his chiropractic patients. Today he's going to tell us why we should use Hot Cherry Pillows and demonstrate how he uses them on his patients. Dr. Binkley? Hi, I'm Dr. Todd Binkley. Why do I use hot cherry pillows? I like hot cherry pillows the best because they're a moist heat and they're easy to use and there are all kinds of different applications for heat, but the dry heat isn't, uh, doesn't work as well for most of them as moist heat does. And I also don't like the use of electrical currents directly on the body for, for a lot of reasons. So uh, if you've got a microwave and a hot cherry pillow, then you're good to go. You can have heat ready for you anytime you want. And I also use them in my, in my office. So we're gonna do a little demonstration of how I use a hot cherry pillow in my office. Colleen, would you join us? So we're just going to have you lie face down and when I use this in the office it comes out pretty hot so I don't put it directly on the patient. I first cover them with a blanket. If they had on a really thick sweater then I might skip the blanket. But otherwise I cover like that and then I just cover the entire spine with the pillow like that. And then I also put another blanket on top of the hot cherry pillow to keep it warm. And that way it'll stay nice and warm for a good half hour, which is about the right time, 20 minutes to 30 minutes. And so this works great for relaxing the spine. Whenever I put one of these on a patient, there's usually a, some kind of a feedback like, ah, oh, wow, awesome, thank you. Things like that. So I try not to get them in the habit of wanting it every time they come in, but it does work really well. And so while she's uh, sitting here baking, um, there are a number of other things that I use them for. Any, any time or any place you have a hot muscle that needs relaxing, then the hot cherry pillow works great for that. So for example, menstrual cramps, um, tight muscles in the neck, um, in the extremities, a cramp in the leg. Uh, the main thing to remember though is to not use heat when you suspect inflammation is present which is anytime right after a recent injury. If you've torn something, if you feel a really sharp pain, if you feel pain radiating like a nerve style pain, then you probably have inflammation and that's not the best time to use heat. Uh, but if you just have a, a tight sore muscle or something that's been aching for a long time, then really in any part of your body, you can put a hot cherry pillow on it. Other examples would be for um, this, a psoas muscle spasm. A lot of people that have low back pain don't even know about the psoas muscle, but it's one of your core muscles and you can lie on your back and put that on your tummy um, and that is effective at relaxing that muscle. Another thing that um, a lot of people don't realize you can use it for is for uh, an inflamed gallbladder. I just said don't put it on something that's inflamed, but the gallbladder is when somebody has a, a gallbladder that's acting up, when they know that their gallbladder is giving them trouble, um, it's usually congealed fat in there that can be in a way melted by putting the hot cherry pit pillow on it. Um, I was just talking to my mother just a, f a couple of weeks ago and it was interesting because I often give the hot cherry pillows for gifts too, people love them. And my mother told me just a couple of weeks ago that, that uh, apropos of nothing, that the hot cherry pillow I gave her uh, for Christmas a couple of years ago was her favorite gift that I ever gave her. She still uses it in bed to warm her feet every night.